All right. First and foremost, I introduce myself again. Javier Starks is my name. I'm very happy to be here, John Quinn. At the LAYC Career Academy in Washington, D.C., this lunch break comes with a show. Be the person on which everybody can depend. I hate when the world is against me and all my friends are just in my head. Javier Starks is one of so many aspiring artists trying to make a name in the music industry. But there's another facet to his career, motivator, youth advocate. To Starks, classrooms are just as important as club stages. To me, MCing is like sharing a story, sharing whatever is on your mind, you know what I'm saying? I don't curse in none of my songs. I go to schools because I don't curse any of my songs. You go to college because you speak to the students you know, in this particular audience are between 16 and 24. For various reasons, the traditional high school to college path to a career wasn't an option. I felt like they would be able to relate with his story and see how you can come from something that doesn't look so positive and go into something that does look positive. Despite the clean language and the upbeat message, Starks doesn't sugarcoat his own story. And I'm here as a person who's experienced the streets. I've sold drugs. I've done drugs. I know friends who have died from overdoses, friends who died from car crashes, friends who died getting robbed, etc., etc., etc. So Starks has coupled a message with a key medium. I listen to music all day long with my daughter. I'll listen to music all day. Social media, an active presence on Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, and more, has helped him widen his virtual reach. He hopes crowdfunding will jumpstart plans for classrooms beyond D.C. What you have within you, the skills that you have, the people around you, that is your value. That is what makes you who you are and puts you in a position to be successful. Inspiring their dreams. No fear, the future to me. As he works so toward clear. achieving his own. In Washington, I'm Karen Kafa.